Burner's dead guy. And then there's the door. Um, hi, Ultar. Hello again, Ultar. Praise be to Allah. I am blessed with your bountiful presence once more. Ooh. Oh, ask him about the notes. Yeah, that would make sense. Could you tell me what that sign means? It's a door stay shut until brush come back. Signed, the management. Oh, well, what does that mean? Manager buy lovely new toilet brush, leaves it by wash basin for ten minutes, come back, it's been stealing. Stolen. Not even out of wrapper. He damn cross. Lock up toilet and say, nobody use fine pristine toilet until brush given back. We say, what we do till then, eh? He say, cross legs and use superior willpower. And that's what you've been doing? No. Ultar use bucket. <laughs> gross. That's, yeah, that's gross. I mean, you can at least go somewhere else, right? <laughs> it would be bad for business for him, though, but, you know, whatever. Um. What do you make of that boy in the market, Nejo? Nejo? Ha! Ayub's boy is too big for sandals. I speak splendid English and he laugh. He say, Ultar, you big ox, you split infinitive. I say, I split your head if you stay still long enough. <laughs> Pretty funny, yes? Hilarious. You should be on cable. This place is certainly hard to find. Oh, yes, it is most exclusive. The membership can be no more than... Hmm. Kind sir, what would you guess the population of the village to be? Gee, I don't know, a couple of thousand? Then I would estimate the membership to be no more than a couple of thousand. <laughs> Plus one, because I'm, I'm here, so... Um... Have you met the American couple? Have Ultar met them? Have Ultar met them? Yes, Ultar have met them. And? The most ungenerous. Ultar offer to show them wonders of countryside. They say, is there anything ancient? Ultar say, yes, of course. Nature is ancient. They say, no, anything ancient made by men. And Ultar say, have you seen taxi? Fan belt older than Ozymandias. <laughs> but they gone. What do you know about the kebab seller? A most miserable man. Ultar say, cheer up, matey mate. It might never happen. And he say, shut up, Ultar. Fancy that. Not at all. Arto has face like the drizzle that falls on the midweek afternoon. Whatever that is. I don't... I, I just don't think we're going to get any nights. Templar info out of him. Not at all. Shake my hand, Ultar. Ha ha. Remind me of thing that happened month ago. Maybe six. Man come up to Ultar, say, Shake hands, Ultar. But man have electric buzz thing in his hand. Ha ha. How we laughed. Then I broke his arms. I didn't think electrocuting the big Syrian was a good idea. Yeah, maybe not. Maybe not. Um, See you around, Ultar. May good fortune follow you, mister. Thanks for translating, so we're gonna go down to Nijo. Or Nejo. I, I, I don't like how George first calls him Nijo, and then to Ultar he says Nejo. Just, what is his name then? Consistency is uh, preferred. I mean, if anyone's got a toilet brush, it's going to be Nijo, right? Hi, Nijo. Hello again, sir. And how may I help you this time? I can't... No, not even toilet... Aw, oh, boo. Um, well... Look at this. A lifting key as used by Parisian sewer workers. Kalu Kalei, sir. I must remember this day for posterity. My grandchildren will be fascinated. <laughs> Do you know the name Merlin? I'm afraid not, old bean. Hey. What can I do with a blood pressure gauge? Don't tempt me to tell you, sir. 
What do you think of this, eh? Oh, sir, what a splendid... Oh, God, look at his face. One day, when I am rich, I am going to build a world-renowned collection of brightly colored balls. Are you serious? In deadly earnest, people will come from far and wide to see my... Yes? Collection. <laughs> the Rockefellers and the Gettys can keep their hordes of so-called fine art. But answer me this. What good is a Picasso, I ask you, if you cannot bounce it off a wall? You may have a point. <laughs> oh wait, we can bring that up again. I also loved how, you know, the pause for Nijo was very well timed. <laughs> Seriously, do you really think this thing's so great? Take it away, you tempter! I'll swap it for something off your stand. Um, due to seasonal financial considerations, I'm afraid I cannot. I thought you wanted this thing. I do, sir. This stand doesn't. Which in translation meant it's not really my stand, and I'll be in big trouble if I swap anything for something that I want myself. Alternatively, is there any service that you require? Not at the moment, but I'll bear it in mind. There is a service. I need to know who to st So long, Nijo. Toodle pip, sir. Yes, toodle pip to you too. Um So we can get a service from Nijo, which so to me sounds exactly like what we need, but um Yeah, I need a toilet brush. Suddenly. I realized the horrific truth. What? The guy was basting the kebabs with a toilet brush. Oh, oh what? Really? Really? Uh, now that is random. Um. I'd value your opinion on this, sir. Nah, you buy kebab. None? Well, goodbye. Have a nice day. Most good. Well, I guess that service would be for Nijo to talk to him and give that toilet brush to us. And this is all to achieve what? To go into the toilet at a club in Syria. Yeah, great. Hi, Nijo. Hello again, sir. And how may I help you this time? I'm just really glad that I, I just pressed all the items, even though it is really not a fun way to do it, but um yeah, having to, you know, use the cloud use that twice on the specific character, yeah, that's just a really bad way to progress, but uh Look, this is going to sound a bit strange, but I need Arto's brush What? The brush he bastes the kebabs with? Yes let me find some dirty postcards for you instead. Nijo, this is serious. Ardo stole that brush he's using from a friend, and I want to get it back. Perhaps I could help you, old chap. Uh, maybe? Perhaps? Maybe what? Perhaps what? I do not wish to see mercenaries, sir, but uh, I am a merchant, and merchants trade. Merchant? This isn't Sears and Roebuck here. Well, if you're going to be disagreeable... No, no, you're right. Uh, what would you like? Oh, come on. I seem to recall that you have something that might alleviate my boredom. A globe of delight. A Rubicon spheroid of heavenly pleasure. You mean the ball, don't you? A tiny spherule of form that barely spans my hand, yet promises hours of amusement. If you mean the ball, why don't you just say so? Can I have the ball back, mister? Ball back? You never had it in the first place, kiddo. But, uh, sure. Alright, here you go. Thank you, sir. People say bad things about Americans. But you're okay in my book. What people? What bad things? Never mind that now. Remember the brush? Right, yes, the brush. All you have to do with Arto is be polite. It lightens his day, makes it all worthwhile for him again. How can I be polite to the guy when I can't speak a word of Syrian? Arabic. That's what I meant. Simply memorize this phrase. Il-Akh il-Kalb. Il-Akh il-Kalb. Close enough. 
Now, go over to Arto and deliver those honeyed words even unto his delicate ear. He won't be able to do enough for you. Really? Really. Why? That, that is not going to be a positive thing, is it? I wonder what that actually means. <laughs> We're probably going to insult his mother or something. Hello again, sir. Hello. Kebab? Mmm. Yes. Um. Il Akul Kalb? Filthy. Bad. Bad. Yeah. I kill you. Hey, now. Oh, calm down. I just. Feet. Do your thing. Oh yeah, we definitely uh, insulted his mother or something. Is he just not chasing us or... <laughs> what the hell? No? Okay, guess we'll go down. Wait, what did he do with the brush now? Huh. Hello again, sir. Filthy bat. Okay, okay, I'm go. Okay, so he ran up the stairs, and I I don't know. Nijo, can you tell me what's going on? I, I'm so very confused at what the hell what I'm the doing heck here. Did you tell me to tell him. Patience, sir. Patience. Patience? I've been chased by a homicidal kebab seller, and you expect me to be patient? But consider, sir, while you were running from the irate Arto, the irate Arto wasn't using the brush. He was. Hold on. Are you telling me that I've been used as a diversionary tactic? Your brush, sir. All right, thanks. I can't believe that you put me on that kebab seller's death list for a toilet brush. The ends justified the means, sir. Yeah, but I noticed it wasn't your butt that was on the line, though. They also serve who only stand and wait, sir. Oh, spare me. Seriously, George. So long, Toodle peep, sir. George, what has happened to you? You were chasing murderers and now. You're in a foreign country, and all you can care about is a fucking toilet brush. Seriously, you've stooped very, very low, George. Very, very low. Now go deliver the toilet brush, and go take a very generous piss or something. I don't know. You really seem to want this, so... Here you go. Here's your brush, sir. It wasn't easy getting it back. The manager took the brush from me, gave me the toilet keys as my reward, and stomped off. What was all that about? Manager, he say, Bah, look at state of this. Need much cleaning in detergent before go around my you bend. He said all that? Body language account for much, you know. Oh, yes, indeedy. <laughs> okay, uh, well, keys, meet door. Alright, alright, this is really all we, you know, aspire to do here. Get in, get in here. We can't even do anything with the outside window? Okay. It was a roller towel dispenser. Okay. <laughs> the mirror was as clean as anything else in there. That was very helpful. Um, uh, so far, I'm not regretting doing all this at all. And I thought the French had strange toilets. I hadn't drunk anything since the morning, and I didn't need to use it. 
Yet, you go through all this trouble to get into the 